Welcome to my channel, Sundra Allie Loves Disney. If it's your first time stopping by, hi, my name is Allie. Today's video is a Spring Disney movie tag, and it's a tag that was created by one of my best friends, Nina, over at the channel Wrestling with Disney. And she created a couple different prompts, and I have not prepared any answers, so I'm gonna go ahead and look at the prompts. I'll be looking down at the computer here um, and asking the questions. So there's only a couple. So let's start with the first one. The first one is a movie that had a rough start but ends beautifully, just like spring opens with winter and ends in summer. Now, if you've been watching me for a while, you'll know that I haven't watched a lot of Disney movies. I've watched some, you know, some of the classics. It's been quite a while since I've seen, like 20, 25 years since I've seen them. So, you know, like I watched some as a kid, but I don't remember. Um, so I'm going to just go off of like what's in my memory or like what recent things I've seen. And it'll probably be a combination of Marvel and uh, old school Disney. So. The movie that's coming to mind on this, because I remember when I first sat down and watched it, it had a slow start, a rough start. I was like not really into it and then it kind of shifted for me. And that is Cinderella 2. And that's because the whole starting of that movie was really slow, but the, the ultimate uh, message behind it that was at the end was really, really nice. So that's my choice for the first one. The second one is A New Beginning, your favorite Disney movie series to watch from the beginning. Disney movie series. And I'm thinking that's maybe like um, sequels, like um, movies that have sequels, like Cinderella has three sequels. Um, and yeah, a few of the movies, like there's a few that have two, like Ariel had two, Pocahontas had two. But I'm gonna go with um, I'm gonna go with a Marvel movie, and it's the Avengers, the Avengers movies. Now, not the actual ones that were titled Avengers. So they're um, those movies. Captain America: Civil War kind of had Avengers in it, and kind of started like it kind of started a new group of people that were in the Avengers, but. That one, I can't count because it's technically not an Avenger movie. It's I'm going with the ones titled Avengers, and I will say Avengers. Okay, next one is Time to Get Back Outside, a movie that helps you appreciate the beauty of the outdoors. Now, that one that comes to mind is one that I saw probably around a year ago, and so it's still kind of fresh in my mind, and that is Sleeping Beauty and the scenes where Aurora is like, um, you know, living in the forest when she's away from the kingdom and living with the three fairies and stuff. And it just has like, you know, a nice beauty um, gardens and the animals and stuff like that. So I like that one. Okay, uh, let's see. Spring Fever, a movie you're sick of hearing about. Huh. Um, well, that's a tough one because some of the ones that I've heard, I hear a lot about or I hear the names of, I haven't actually seen, so I'm not sure. But I know that I heard a lot about Onward at one point, so I don't necessarily want to say that I'm sick of hearing about it. I, I, a lot of people talked about it, but I have, haven't seen it and I definitely want to, so I want to judge that for myself. So that's just where I'm going to leave that question. Okay, Spring Musical, one of your favorite Disney musicals, if not your favorite. Well, of course, that one is going to be Cinderella. But if I go live action, I definitely have to put The Beauty and the Beast up there. I absolutely loved that movie. I did a review on it. I'll link that video. But I loved everything about that movie, the songs, everything they did. So that one's definitely in the running. Okay, two prompts left. Mother's Day, a movie that makes you think of motherhood, your mother, etc. Motherhood. Um. <laughs> uh, okay, this is probably going to be way off scale here, but there was a movie we watched just a couple days ago that I did think about my mom on because of a song that was played, and you guys are going to go like, what in the heck was I thinking when I tell you the movie? Okay, so the movie is 
Deadpool, the first Deadpool. And in the very beginning of that movie, they play a song. It's a slow, sweet song. And my mom used to play that her, that um, artist's album all the time when I was young. And so that song and some of her others always stuck with me and always remind me of my mom every time I hear them. So literally when that movie first started and the song played, I thought about my mom. Okay, the last question. Spring aesthetic. A movie that gives you the vibes of spring. The vibes of spring. Shoot, well that would have probably fell under Sleeping Beauty would have been a good one for that. I'm trying to think of something else that I have seen recently that kind of sticks in my mind and nothing is coming to mind. So let me pause. I really had to think about this one. I kind of looked at some of the movies that I have watched and I came up with an answer I think will suffice and it is A Bug's Life. Especially because in that one they're going from spring to summer gathering all their foods so that when they go into winter and then it comes back around to spring kind of thing. So I thought that would be a good one. So really great tag Nina. Thank you for creating this tag. Thank you for tagging me in this tag. And now it's my turn to tag a few people. I am going to tag my friend Kaylee over at the channel Kaylee Hopkins. And then I'd like to tag Rochelle and Donna over at the Dantes. And then Taryn from Twinklebill Taryn. And if anyone else would like to do it, please do let me know so I can watch it and uh, make sure to give Nina a shout out for creating it. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already done so, please do consider hitting the subscribe button and sticking around. And as always, make it a Disney day.